I think the other thing is, you know, I was pretty aggressive on the headset uh, with the staff of getting those guys in the game. Uh, I thought the reps that we got were awesome and they're going to be really, really valuable long term. But those guys, when they go in, they have to live up to the standard. And we did not do that today with our with our depth guys, with our backup guys. So that'll be something that you know, that is something that we addressed in the locker room. That'll be something we'll address during the week. But uh, we are one and oh, and uh, you know, we continue to build this thing and look forward to next week's opportunity. Uh, just be more vocal with the team, just, uh, you know, fundamentals and stuff like that. That's all I think. Every time, it always comes out of front of me. So that's all this is about. Uh, we talk about stuff like that. All security, things like that. Don't put the ball on the ground. Don't put the ball on the ground. Yeah, I, I think to your point is you, you have to play to your strengths, but you have to recognize your weaknesses and you have to work on them. And, and there's that balance. You know, what we don't want to do is obviously abort the passing game, especially with the weapons that we have right now, and go all run game, because then you won't be where you want. So we just have to gradually take steps in the run game, continuing to get better in the passing game, which I still think there's a lot of areas for improvement there as well. Um, but it's not like, to your point, it's not like we're going to come in next week and rush for 400 yards. We just have to get better uh, and, and continue to emphasize it and work it in.